San Juan worms. They're really technical. I'm going to show you how to tie one. It has a little tungsten belly. It's nothing special, but we're still going to do it. Fight me. Okay, stop what you're doing, like, subscribe. It's very important. If you don't do that, the fly ninjas are gonna come to your house and punch you in the neck. Not really, but maybe. All right, so this is a real easy fly. We're just gonna tie a little San Juan worm variation. It's kind of a dumb pattern, but you should have it in your box. It's just a San Juan worm with a bead tied, or the, the bead strung through the middle. So as you can see, I've got a hook in the vise that is upside down. And I'm gonna thread this piece of uh, ultra chenille on the bead before I tie it in. And the way I do that is I just singe the end of this, uh, this chenille and just poke it through the bead. Um, just like that. And then you can pull it through now I'm just going to thread this on small side first, thread that around the hook, and now we're in business. I guess we could just glue it and then we don't have to tie this fly for you. Um, I'm going to first of all trim this down to size, about right there, and singe the other end now. Now the singy singe is done. And I'll just take some 70 denier thread and wrap this on at an angle. We'll build up a nice base here. All right, so I'm gonna want my bead to end up about right there. So I'll use a pinch wrap to wrap this around and I'll do like three or four wraps right in the same spot. Now, the next bunch of wraps, I've advanced my thread underneath the chenille, but forward, and we're gonna do three or four wraps, and do the same thing to about right there. So once we're here, I will just hand whip finish, and that's where our bead's gonna sit. Dab a little bit of super glue here. You might see my thread almost came undone. That's why you don't hand whip finish. Never as good as the tool. All right. So I'll reattach my thread under here. Start with three or four turns of thread at that point and then I'll just build up a little bit of a body and then just catch that in right behind the eye whip finish it and then with this one you definitely want to make sure to glue glue the the underside of this makes this a lot more durable. So this is designed to be a real simple tie. Um, worms are typically a fly that you're fishing close to the bottom so you will break this off but uh, this is a fly that's actually in the fulling mill catalog so it must catch fish somewhere.